Hey everyone, MCQs are now the latest method of evaluation and are very important part of all our exams. So here we are going to discuss the MCQs and objective type papers for class 12th home science. Remember the MCQs and objective questions are now in around one third of the paper. The total marks is included in the MCQs or one markers. So without wasting any time, let's discuss the MCQs. The first is, which is a condition that results from nutrient deficiency or overconsumption? Because nutrient deficiency and overconsumption both are given, so it will be malnutrition. Malnutrition includes overnutrition and undernutrition. The choice is, which is the most common cause of child blindness? IDD or iodine deficiency, vitamin A deficiency, protein energy malnutrition or iodine deficiency so obviously vitamin a deficiency vitamin a causes childhood blindness or night blindness so let's move ahead question number two which of the following conditions are required by the bacteria to grow and multiply is it sunlight moisture suitable temperature or both b and c we have already discussed the method of answering mcqs in case you have missed out that video just go out and find it it will be very helpful if you don't know the answer, but the best method of preparing for MCQs is to be prepared. And we are preparing for those. So the answer is both B and C. That is, you need both moisture and suitable temperature. Sunlight, it restricts bacteria growth. Question number three. Dash means the color, flavor, taste, texture and nutritional value of a food is unsuitable and not edible to humans. It means the answer is food spoilage. It is only spoilage which renders food unsuitable and unedible. The next question is food safety and quality cannot be ensured through cannot be ensured through HACCP, GMP, GHP and PFA. Obviously HACCP, GMP, GHP these are all related to food safety and quality. The answer is PFA. Can you tell me the full form of all these? Just give the answer in the comment box. Let me see how thorough you are. In case you have forgotten, go back to the lesson and revise. Next is, dash is not a physical hazard. Hair, fly, stone or button. Fly, fly is an insect. It is not a physical hazard. Rest, hair, stone, fly, these are all physical hazards. Let's move ahead to question number 5. Juveniles who are found guilty in terms of violation of law are placed in the custodial care in which kinds of home? Juveniles are the children who are below 18 years of age. They might be abandoned or they might have done some crime. So the one who have violated law are placed in special homes. We have already discussed it. There are different types of home and SOS. This you can already eliminate. These are the these are private villages, these are for private organizations which are useful for orphan children and they offer home like environment. Next is question number six. Match the following hotel, furnished camp, lodge, or resorts. You have to match them with provide space on rent, provide accommodation. Hotel, can you identify it? Furnished camp, camp hai to wo, zaroor hiking se related hoga. It's very simple. Resorts, they provide beauty and comfort. Also, hotels mein to you get meals and lodge, lodge mein sirf aapko space milta hai. So, ek answer is, bolo, it's B. To ek answer agar B hai, to obviously the choice is B. Kyunki A ke saath you don't have any other. The choice is very simple now. Process of adding sugar to make jam, jelly and sauces etc. is called? What is it called? Canning, drying, pasteurization or refrigeration? Canning. If you are making jam, you have to add sugar and this is canning. Obviously, by drying, pasteurization, pasteurization to milk ka hota hai. Usse you cannot make jam or jelly. Next question number 8. Dash level is the first level of contact of individual, family or community with the health system. Which will be the first step? It will be, if it is first First say samaj mein aara hai, this is primary. So it is the primary health system. Now the MCQs are over. The answer was B. We move on to objective questions. Objective questions are very short questions. Let us begin with question number 9. Dash measures are taken 
for nutritional assessment nutritional assessment where we diagnose any nutritional problem in a child so what are these these are anthropometric measurements anthropometric measurements these measurements are taken anthropometric measurements that all the measurements of a child are taken and by the those measurements we tally them with the normal measurements of a child now india is likely to be the dash capital of the world you have to attempt any one and which capital of the world diabetic finally you will find most of the diabetic people in our country and that is why it is said we will be the diabetic capital of the world now 10th question dash is the act of creating a new and innovative enterprise product or service act of creating new and innovative enterprise product or a service what can it be you all know it you have already done a program on it also this is entrepreneurship this is entrepreneurship where you try for new things so now we come to 11th question these this is photo based question here you have been given two arts the first is uh, you, what if what is it can you identify it write it down in the comment box if you know it the the answer is Chanapatna dolls of Karnataka. Kaha ka yard? Karnataka. Okay. And the second one, this we are repeating. This is very simple. This is world yard. The state is Maharashtra. This is all you have to write down. Simple. Now we move over to the twelfth, thirteenth, and fourteenth question. Twelfth question. Draw the standardized mark which is found on the water bottle. Water bottle पे क्या होता है? It is ISI. So you have to make the symbol of ISI. Okay. Thirteenth question. Predict two benefits of SOS Children Village for the children. Do you remember when we were talking of how to attempt the MCQs? I'll give you the link. I told you that in case you don't know the answer. Read rest of the paper. Many a times you will find the answers somewhere else. तो हमने पहले भी देखा था S O S village was there where we had to eliminate it. Now here you have to give the two benefits of S O S children village which is there for the children. Can you tell me what what are the those advantages? It could be that it provides a mother to around ten to fifteen children. And because you have a mother, you have family links. and if you have family links you give emotional and social security to a child the child becomes and social security and the child becomes independent and he has social value social relations next is your sister wants to send her 3 year old son to montessori school write two reasons for choosing such a school What are the main features of a Montessori school? The first was that the children are taught by the playway method, and very important is here the approach is child centered. You for you may use the techniques which are child centered based upon the interest of the child. You can write any two. The second part there is a choice between these two questions. Rina wants to send her two year old daughter in a crèche. Here we were talking of a school, and here it is a crèche. Which two features would you? She look in selecting a good crèche. Now just apply it on you and think what are the things you look for in a good crèche. It should be safe. It should have good uh, games to play. It can have if it is a two year old child. It should have resting place. It should provide feed or food to the child. then there should be a trained nurse and a trained teacher or a caretaker then you should have first aid it should be neat hygienic so you can just write down any two and you will get two no one mark for two points so this is pretty simple all this objective questions we have of solved we'll take up all the practice paper these questions are very important and the basic pattern is going to remain the same in the next one we'll take up section 2 or the case study methods and some more important mcqs and remember to see the video which talks about how to attempt the mcqs and take guesses in case you don't know the mcqs so see you in the next video till then bye bye